go. Recording it. Alright, my name is Rich Tucker. Now you've seen me do some Eddie Murphy and some Chris Tucker and some Cat Williams. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to go ahead and do a monologue. This monologue talks about a guy losing his girlfriend in a car accident. It also talks about how he can reorganize his life and get back on track. Here I go. Hope you enjoy. Here it goes. You know what I thought? You know what I think about? It's when you have something to hold and when you have something to, to sit down and hold on to, you never realize that it'll come away from you. Last night, last night, I lost the most important thing of my life. And that was my woman. Sometimes you sit down there and you try to sit back and you try to enjoy life. And you try to figure out what's right. I remember yesterday, me and her were just talking, just having a good old time. And now, she's not talking. We got into an argument and then we said we hated each other. Things just went out of proportion. Rumors got started. People started hating. I couldn't even tell her sister that, hey, we're not together. You know, the hardest thing I've ever had to do in life is admit that I made a mistake with this woman. You never know that you have so many puzzle pieces in life and so many obstacles until you explore what those obstacles are and what those puzzle pieces are. Because everything is just scattered. Everything is just broken up and divided into so many ends. And just when you think you can put them together, just when you think you can put them together, you can't. Because there's always a hole. There's always a barrier. There's always something getting in between those two ends. And I would sit down there and listen to all sorts of music and remember her just rubbing her hands through her hair, looking at her beautiful green eyes, seeing her smile and walk across the stage or a certain platform and pretend she was a model. She had just that look that every guy liked. She was amazing. It should have been me. I should have been the one. I should have went yesterday. Not her. She didn't do anything to deserve to go. She was such a beautiful girl. It should have just, should have just been me. I should have been the one that should have been behind that car. I should have been the one that should have just took her place. Now, now she's gone. With no ends, no buts, no ifs. And I didn't even get a chance to say goodbye. The way I feel right now, I have never felt this way. Because one part of me has a hole and the other part is lost and is gone. Until I find that puzzle piece to put all the puzzle pieces together, there will always be a hole and a void. Well, I guess this is where I get off and say life is going to end. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm done with my video. Thanks for the for the views. I hope you like this monologue. And again, peace out. Rich.